Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Hunter here back with yet another 100% very easy achievement guide and this time we are getting it all in Dead Tomb. Now this was developed by Collective Vision Games, published by 8-Bit Legit and is usually available for just a lovely small $3.99 slash $4.99. So we play as old Colonel McDead Tomb, who uh, ends up going into a tomb full of the dead and has to, you know, do dead tomb stuff. Kind of like Tomb Raider, but nothing like it in the slightest. Right, so uh, as for achievements, this one is... Well, I mean, this is... It, it's easy, okay? It's very easy. We've just got to do uh, certain miscellaneous tasks, go to a couple of places, and the full 1000G will be yours in probably easily a little under five minutes. Uh, yes, so, I mean, the game... To be honest, this is my type of game anyway. I, I really enjoy these like adventure point and click type games. So it's always worth definitely playing if you fancy it. But if you're just after the achievements, then of course, as I said, we're going to be getting this done in a little under five minutes. So um, <laughs> yeah, with that being said, then uh, let's do it. Uh, so the music is blasting. That's just what you want. So first things first, we are going to get an achievement just for waking up. Uh, left stick to move, of course, the A button to uh, interact with things. So we're going to go over to the right here, move the sand. So you press the A button on an, on an item, um, and obviously we're going to move that one. Uh, so we're going to move the sand there three times for another achievement. Next, we're going to go down to use, and then we're going to use the hole. Oh, that's way too easy, way too easy. So uh, once you've used the hole and you've um, got an Uber out of there, uh, we will just, you can see like this little thing in the bottom left hand corner, we're going to go to the right. Uh, you can still go, um, obviously interact with stuff, so go to the interrogation room here. Uh, click on the backpack, then click open, and then of course open the backpack. Oh, they left something inside, been that be my hole. Next we're going to take the Yoli TX. Yoli, uh, hee-hoo, or something. So once you've taken that one, we will go to the right and we'll be uh, in this little area again. So we need to go to the Apothecary, which is in the top left-hand corner of this little mini-map. There we go. Once we are here, we are going to take Tasty Third Bottle. So go to the third bottle there and uh, go to Taste Bottle and that'll get us another achievement. Yeah. And of course, just avoiding, you know, missing out and not giving a crap about the unfortunate dead skelly skelly people right back to the mini map we're going to go to the cellar which is the bottom right hand corner so get yes get your cellar in the cellar uh go to the rock right in the middle here and we're actually going to move the rock so click on the rock click move and then click rock and if it's Dwayne Johnson and the rock who are twins by the way mad isn't it uh next we're going to take that same rock so you move Dwayne Johnson you're going to take the rock we are ne next going to head back to the left after we get that achievement. And we're going to go to the shrine, which is going to be in the top right corner of this little mini-map. So head into the shrine. Now there's three, uh, there's a nail uh, just in, just next to the exit on the right sticking out of the wall. We're going to take the nail three times. So again, once you've interacted with it, take nail, take nail, and take nail. And once you've done that, another achievement unlocked. We can just go to the right, go back onto this little mini-map. And we're going to go to the supply room, which again is right in front of us, so uh, over to the right. Now, go ahead and stand on the trap door. Next, we're going to use, so click on it, use hammer nail with rock. Tidy boys. And then when you um, obviously go up then to the uh, top pit there, and we're going to tie the rope to the nail. So tie rope to nail, not just rope. Because he's going to be like, nope, nope to the rope. But we're going to take uh, tie the rope to the nail. And then we are going to open trap door with rope. So if you uh, be open there with the rope, and you uh, bleh, then you can choose the open trap door with rope. Then you can head down the trap door. Next, we're going to go to the temple, which is going to be again directly in front of us. So all the way to the right. We are going to move this wooden plank. And then once we have interacted with the dagger, so again, we are going to take the dagger right in the middle there. So click take, take dagger, and that is it. That is pretty much, I think, the thousand, the, the easiest thousandth G of the year so far. There's probably going to be a lot more to come. So there we go. For some reason, it didn't unlock straight away, but it did unlock eventually. So uh, yeah, 
<laughs> I guess there we go then, guys and gals. So thank you so, so much for watching. Um, well, I hope you enjoyed the game, and I hope the guide helped as well. If you did, of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share with a friend as well. Big shout out, as always, to my Patreon supporters and my YouTube members. And I shall see you in the next one. Big love to my dead tomb homie bomies.